Police are looking for the person or people who shot at an Indigo bus this morning, hitting a man inside. It happened near the corner of 11th and Central. News 8's Stephanie Esquivel talked with an Indigo rider and people living in the area about the shooting. You never know what's going to happen, so yes, you can't imagine, you know, not riding the bus because that's not my only means of transportation right now, you know, so. I just got to be uh, ready for whatever goes down. James Caldwell says it was shocking to hear about today's shooting. We never knew that was coming to, toward us this way, but it happened. The gunfire erupted just after 6 in the morning near the corner of 11th and Central Avenue. Police say a bullet hit a man riding the bus in the hand. Medics took him to the hospital in stable condition. Caldwell says the shooting worries him. Well, we just have to be careful out here. Homeowners near the intersection where the shooting happened say they're also worried to see crime like that in their neighborhood. We like to be outside and play with our dog and go on walks and meet neighbors, so everybody seems friendly. Deva Adams says that in the past two and a half years that she's lived there, the neighborhood usually stays quiet and calm. But within the past month or so, she says she's noticed an uptick in crime. We had a bike that was stolen, um, and you hear about this stuff, but once it happens to you, you become pretty freaked out about it. And then literally two weeks after that, a man tried to come in through and break into the house. She hopes that this recent spike in crime does not become the new normal in her neighborhood. I don't think that I will ever become accustomed to it, and I don't think that that should be part of this neighborhood or any neighborhood. I would love to see more police around here. I feel like if we don't call, we just don't see them. So I would love to see more of that here. Stephanie Esquivel, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.